Hi, so we have a very important question for the day. It's a very important question related to MBA specialization. And the question says that uh, which would have more value, a specialty MBA from a top school, for example, a technology strategy and a product management MBA track, formerly known as uh, uh, leadership technology track at Carnegie Mellon in collaboration with Tepo, or should I be looking at a general MBA with my preferred specialty as one of the core subjects at the top school. Well, interesting question. So the question is, should I pick a specialization now ahead of time? Or should I move there, pick up a general MBA and have some of the specialized subjects as the, the key electors? I think it really depends on where, where you're headed in life. You know what? If you know and trust yourself and you trust your judgment and know that you want to follow a singular track and are keen on starting with some of the technology companies, then then you can do a specialized MBA. But if you think that the moment you start an MBA and you come across a wide variety of people from different industries, background, functions, different aspirations, and you realize that, hey, you know what? I like this role as well. I'm more suited for some something else. And for example, if somebody told you that, so let's say if somebody told you that if you spent five years in McKinsey, and uh, after that five to seven years in McKinsey, you can spend uh, and uh, you, you can look at some of the core strategy positions in Google and you will wonder, hmm, you know, but that's like a cool idea. That's something that I would want to explore. And this can happen in the first year of an MBA. And, and you know what? I really want you to think from this perspective that some of you will think that, you know what? I'm not even sure if I want to do a, stick to one particular career, but let me start my first year in a big school and I'll do a lot of window shopping. Trust me, it happens. And that is when you will really think, why did I put myself in this particular track without even getting into a B-School, without even knowing that I would want to do and explore a lot of these things. Normally, uh, a specialized MBA will help someone who already has dived deeper into a particular area. Like you've had a very deep dive into whatever you want to do right after the MBA. And somebody like this, he knows about the specialized, he or she knows about the, the specialized programs, he or she is struggling with problems that he or she is struggling with. And is now kind of keen on diving further deeper and is not keen on doing a lot of window shopping. This kind of a person goes to a specialized program. And looking at your question, my gut feeling says that if you're asking or if anyone is currently asking this question, he is not certain of what he wants and is looking at an MBA purely from a perspective of return on investment, like purely from an ROI perspective. And that's a great place to think from as well. And if you are confused, you're really doing well. And trust me, it is absolutely fine to be confused and to be lost. And if you belong to this category, go do an MBA, which is very, very strong in general management. Some of these programs have already done whatever research that was needed to design the curriculum. If they wanted to place someone in, if, I mean, if they have to place somebody in consulting or on the Wall Street or uh, in a Fortune 500 company, they already have an understanding of what is needed and why do you need to learn whatever you need to learn. Go and evolve. And, and really, welcome to the world where you'll actually do a lot of window shopping for careers. You will be impressionable. You will really enjoy that and you will explore very, very diverse opportunities. And trust your learning curve when you're there in that top tier MB program. See, you will experience the steepest learning curve in one year, in the first year of an MBA program. And the person you will start to become at the end of the first year, let that kind of person decide what career is a great option for him. Not right now. The future version of you, let that decide. And you are doing a great job if you are really diving deeper into finding out about your goals at this stage. But you don't have to make decisions that change the course of your life at this stage. As in, don't pick up a specialization when you know you are not very, very sure. Don't do this. Don't do it at least with this mindset. I really hope it helped. Go rock. I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.